Howdy everybody, Big Fat Plus, and welcome back to the Big Man Plays Ghostbusters. When last left off, we were doing some tethering. Because we were trying to find a way out. I'm just gonna go through here. Ray, it occurs to me that these events are interrelated. The Bozerian exhibit, the huge energy oh. the Sedgwick Hotel, the return of Stay Puff. Yeah. Yes, even this, <sighs> all pointing back to a single point of origin. Elissa? Elissa. Oh, lovely. I think she's a factor in this. Maybe not intentionally, but almost definitely. Yes, we're in the spirit world. We're trying to get out. And Peter is currently with Elissa. Probably getting his Peter on. <laughs> yes, I had to make that joke. And I have no idea where. Yeah, you go right ahead there, uh, buddy. I'm just gonna go back here and uh, see if there's anything back here I can scan. Have fun. There's not a damn thing here. I, can I, I love this. It looks all Gozarian. And it's bugly. You need to cool down. Punk ass thing. Alright, let's go in here. How you doing? Oh, you're a cultist. Hey, can you can you calm down? Can you chill? You're not Okay, I really need to not do that. Hey, cultist, could you um Where's my shotgun? Cultist? Where, okay, I can purchase an upgrade. Of course you do purchase an upgrade. Of course. Also, how about we just see who this was? Class 3 elevated remnant. Ghost must trap. Shandor's... <laughs> Shandor, of course! Shandor! Oh, with these frickin' names, I swear. Shandor's hold or, uh, horde of Gozer worshippers are drawn from around the world. Shandor cultivated his minions carefully, drawing followers both from the world's most affluent quarters and from the halls of intelligentsia. That's a new word for me. Never heard of that. That's a new word going right into the grammar book. Right there. He promised them all stations of power and glory in the new post-Gozer millennia, while secretly binding them to his own service in life and afterwards. Though fairly powerful entities, these cultists seem to be subservient to other more powerful creatures. Of course. So, let's um, run around here. I hear you, buddy. I hear you. Oh, hey, there you are. And there you went. Sir, could you stop running around? I would like to... What? Oh. Activate my trap when I didn't need to. Sir, could you could you stand and deliver, please? I would like to have a word with you. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay, just need you to... There we go. Ah. <sighs> Give me my trap, please. Thank you, motherfucker. <laughs> Reduce slime consumption. Of course. Why not? Why not buy slime consumption? You know, I, 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 don't, I don't even know anymore. All right. I'm tired of being in this room of mirrors. Reminds me of that freaking place in Dread Out. So many goddamn mirrors. I hate it. Lots of Gozerian writing. I swear I'm going to make another character at Star Trek Online and name him Gozer. Up oh, some things here. Some things here. I'm not liking these motherfucking cobwebs, I tell you that much right now. I swear if I have to deal with a freaking giant spider, I'm gonna be very unhappy. 
Okay, what seems to be the... What am I looking for? I have no idea what I was looking for. Is it over here? It's, there's something here. No, my luck, it's probably a flipping co a collectible. Sorry about that, my little sister's yelling at her anime in the next room, so I'm like... Okay, what the hell? Is something here? In case you're wondering, she's watching uh, Magic Knights Ray Earth. Probably on the other damn side. That's gonna be my guess. Probably in on the other side of the wall. Yep, that's gonna be proven right there. Okay, I'm gotta be getting close to some. Oh, I'm definitely close to whatever it is now. Ow. What am I getting close to? Oh. That's lovely. I love the orchestral themes in this game. I do love that. It looks lovely. Okay, might as well just come around through. Oh. That's... Um. Uh -huh. I don't really want to be here at all. Just, 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 uh, just an observation. I don't want to be here at all. I don't want to be here at all in any way, shape, form, fashion, or type. Uh I really don't want to be here. In the okay, god uh, damn. Um, tried this one twice already. So it's got to be another one. You've tried that one twice already. Am I gonna stand here and watch you go through the same damn portal 70 times? No. I'm not. I'm just gonna go up here. Cause I'm the rookie. I'm the main character. Is extremely volatile. It seems to be tearing itself apart. Of course it is. We need to get out of here. No shit, Sherlock. Hmm, what was that? Oh. I bet you I could blast. Okay, let me try that again. Maybe this will do it? Nope. It's probably a way to do it, but... Yeah, let's just uh, equip the happy goo. And I'm just gonna go this way. Lovely. No, how about no? Quit throwing books at me, you dick. This ain't read or die. You can't use paper as a god dang weapon. Did you see something scary, Egon? Stairs. Lots of stairs. Yeah, I would imagine that'd be kind of terrifying to someone who doesn't walk stairs much in their life like me. Egon, you're far more physically fit than I am. So why the hell are you freaking complaining? Unless you're sick and tired of stairs, which I would imagine if you've never owned a Stairmaster in your life, you probably would be sick and tired of stairs. I know I'm sick and tired of stairs. I'm sick and tired of this whole goddamn everlasting freaking place. It's like a freaking MC Escher painting done by by a freaking heavy metal artist. 
Minus the spikes! <sighs> and all I want is a sandwich. I would like a, I, I would like a Reuben, please. A nice New York style delicatessen Reuben. That's what I want. But I'm not gonna get that. You're probably gonna order pizza again like you do every damn thing because you're freaking cheap, you freaking Ghostbusters. And I'm very much questioning the sanity of my choosing to um, join this particular squad. It must the pay must have been very good. Oh, it's starting to make sense. Heads up, boys, wherever you are. Yeah, I see you. I don't know if that's Ray or Egon. I'm not entirely sure, in any way, shape, form, fashion, or type. Totally in. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna leave now. Send a signal we can track you with. I'll try, but it might not work. The last portal I entered was at the top of a long flight of stairs. Top of a long flight of stairs. That's 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 good to know. That's very good to know, there, Egon. How about here's a here's a thought, Egon. I'm not sure if you'll get this. That's a nice thought. How about shoot through the damn... Yeah, you just enjoy that fall, you fucker. How about you shoot through, shoot through the portal? That would be a great idea. Shoot through the goddamn portal. If you shoot through the portal, it might cause a beam to let us see where you, we need to go. Instead of us wandering around continually like a pair of idiots. Oh. She apparently has some trouble staying in the same... Featherwell stalking chair? That's a stalk? A stalking by a chair. Okay! Now, circa 1976. Nate Featherwell, aspiring ventriloquist, had big dreams but not much talent. He spent his life savings on a charm from, from a voodoo priestess. When used correctly, the spell would bring wood to life. They hoped to use it to charm his dummy, Smuggy. They accidentally worked his spell on the chair he sat on instead. The chair, alive but ignored, grew jealous of the attention Featherwell lavished on the inanimate Smuggy, and did away with them both in a rage-fueled wood chipper accident. The chair slipped away and thus remains at large to this day. I would like to know a couple of things. First of all, how did the chair operate a wood chipper? Second of all, how did the chair absconded with the both of them and throw them into the wood chipper. Third of all, how did the chair assault? You know. You know, I don't think it even matters at this point anymore. Made it out too. Hey, champ. We won't leave until you find us. Look for the long staircase. The exit portal is at the very top. Grant, I see a long staircase. That's always good. Now, how much you want to bet I'm going to face a freaking boss when I get to the end of it? Um, I'm being assaulted by books, okay? It's a wave of books that's blocking my path. <sighs> I'll bet Professor Lameza wishes he had this weapon. Probably would have helped his ass. Probably would have helped me to the gut. Let's not get into that rage field hatred uh, bit again. Oh, that, that's lovely. The, 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 the stairs are falling apart. I feel so much. That's... That's Grant. Okay, how am I supposed to get through this? Hmm? I'll die before I ever get through. No, screw it. At this juncture, I could care less. I just want to get out of this horrible M.C. Escher-inspired hell. 
This is a, this is a nightmare of MC Escher. This is what it is. Okay, where's my shotgun, please? Okay, that's always good. Yeah, just keep blasting them until such time as uh, I can get through. Good. Good enough. Um, this floor is, yeah, the structural integrity of this place is severely suspect, and why does it look like an evil version of Jar Jar Pinks? Trouble getting to the portal. Use the slime tether to bring the portal to you. Where's the portal? Okay, maybe I just take you this. Oh, what the hell is this? Accidental runner now? Frickin' no. <laughs> no, you will not do this bullshit straight away. You will not do that bullshit to me. Oh, uh, yes. Hey, Cadet, are you okay? Sounds like it's getting closer. Can you get to that portal at the top of the stairs? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get there, buddy. I'm trying to get there. Okay, so this is, this is an interesting little bit here. Very interesting. Interesting puzzle solving mechan X. Very, very interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm liking this. I'm not so much liking the height differential here. I'm really not liking that. That this, the, the height I could do without severely. Okay, I guess I'm gonna wait. Aha. Okay, hope I'm not missing a freaking. Okay, good, thank you. Yes, let's leave. Let's, 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 let's get the frick out of this horrible, horrible place that I never ever want to see again because. I uh... really like what they've done with the place here, but I hope that portal would have taken us back to the library. Actually, we are back in the public library. The no, we're not. The membrane must be extremely thin here. Someone's holding us here. The collector. Yes, of course. As it lore wants to add to his collection, and he's probably not too happy about us taking the Gozerian Codex with us. Oh yeah, what can a twisted little bookworm do to scare us? He murdered Eleanor Twitty for it when he was alive, and a dozen others just to cover it up. And collector, we're taking your book. What do you think about that? Ray. Ah, uh, he's right behind me, isn't he? Yes, he is. I think you got his attention, Ray. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, so is the collector this this part or is it Okay, no, he has a full body. Okay. Hey! As as it lore. Okay. Okay. Okay, so let me look at as it lore the blacks the destroyer. Class 6, Elevated Remnant. Type, Deity. Supreme Being. Behaviors, Attack, okay. Da, 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 da. As it lore, Keeper of Knowledge was once a powerful leader in Shandor's Cult of Gozer. And as a reward for a lifetime of service, was given eternal life as a transformed demigod in the twisted ghost world plane. Now, Golem-like, he clothes himself in a dense skin of environmental debris that, with the addition of his massive... Reserves of PK energy makes him a devastating and dangerous opponent that will probably take a very long time for me to defeat. Because, of course, he will. So, is As It Lord the Destroyer going to kill me several bunches of times? Am I going to have to, uh, just get the Cliff Notes version of him? <laughs> Book humor there, I hate it. Find out next time on The Big Man Plays Ghostbusters, the video game. Till then, it's Big Fatty Plus. Sayonara. And, you know, you think this motherfucker would have picked a different form, you know? 
you know, for 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 his eternal life you know, form. Personally, I would rather pick the guy with a big dick, but um, I guess this man loves books way too goddamn much. I mean, good lord! I mean, he loves books so much he made himself into a bunch of books and everything. And that picture also looks like he's also part of a goddamn chair. I guess he likes to be able to sit down every once in a while. 